Hi, kindergarten friends. We are really starting to get the hang of these teen numbers, aren't we? Today, our focus is going to be on the numbers 17 and 18. Wow, we are already up to 17 and 18. Okay, so let's get started by counting up to 18. Count with me. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Excellent job. Thanks for counting with me. So we are going to start by talking about the number 17 today. Just like with our other lessons, please make sure that you have a 10 frame ready. Draw a 10 frame if you don't have one, and you will need at least 18 objects to use for counters. You can use pennies, objects, toys, whatever you want. But we're going to use those as counters. So if you don't have your 10 frame or at least 18 objects, pause the video and make sure you get them so you're ready to learn. Okay, so now let's talk about 17. Our T numbers are a group of 10 and then some more. So right now I have an empty 10 frame, so I'm going to need your help to fill that 10 frame. As I draw my counters, you take your objects, put them in your 10 frame, in the same order that I'm doing it, just like I do it. Okay, so make sure you're doing that with me so we can start with our group of 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good, you should have a full 10 frame now. Your 10 frame should have 10 objects in it. If you have that, you're ready to go. Excellent. So we know that our T numbers are a group of 10 and then some more. So starting for 17, we're starting with a group of 10 and then we need more. So let's find 10 up here on my number line. There's 10. Now I know I need to get to 17 to figure out how many more. So let's start at 10. I'm gonna go 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So I added one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I went from 10 to 17, I jumped ahead seven. So I know that 17 is a group of 10 and seven more. So I'm gonna draw seven more counters. As I do that, I want you to take your objects that you are using as counters and put them next to your 10 frame. Here we go. So I'm gonna add seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I have a group of 10 and seven more. That makes the number 17. So what is 17? 17 is a group of 10 and seven more. Let's write that as a number sentence. Here we go. So 17 is or is equal to a group of 10 plus seven more. Okay, let's say that number sentence together. Here we go. 17 equals 10 plus seven. One more time. 17 equals 10 plus seven. Please make sure you write that number sentence down to practice so that you can answer that question, what is 17? Excellent. Okay, let's move on to the number 18 now. Just like with 17, we know that um, our T numbers are a group of 10 and then some more. So I'm gonna fill in my 10 frame to get ready. You should still have your full 10 frame from our 17 practice, so you can keep it. Help me count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. There's my group of 10, but we're not learning 10 today. We're talking about 18. So now we have to figure out, okay, how many more do we have to add to 10 to get to 18? Okay, let's see, see, here we are at number 10. 10, now let's count to get all the way up to 18 and see how many more we're adding. All right, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Whoa, so how many fingers do I have up now? I added one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So 18 is a group of 10 and eight more. 
So now I have to make eight counters. You make sure that you have eight objects right next to your 10 frame. I'm gonna count eight. Please count eight with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so now I have a group of 10 and eight more. So what is 18? 18 is a group of 10 and eight more. Let's make our number sentence. Here we go. All right, so 18 equals or is the same as 10 plus eight. What is 18? 18 is 10 plus eight. Okay, so kindergartners, make sure you write down both of these number sentences. I want you to take a picture of those number sentences and share them with your teacher so your teacher can see how hard you are working and that now you understand what is 17 and what is 18. Okay, friends, thanks for learning with me. I'll see you soon. Bye.